Hoes, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. So today I thought I would go ahead and do a quick get ready with me and a review just real quick and show you I had gotten the new Forever, but I got the Volume 2 eyeshadow palette and this one has more, instead of it having the neutral shades, this one has more colors in it. Um, it's pretty much, as you can see, the same packaging, uh, same casing, it's real thick. Magnetic closure um, does come with the thick plastic cover to help your shadows. Another, you know, like a large mirror in there, and um, just pretty much all the same, just the colors. And you get nine shades in there for like, I think it's $42. Like I said, I don't think that's too bad because the sizes of these eyeshadows are almost close to like MAC and Makeup Geek size when you get from them and for $42 and the quality of these product or eyeshadows are really good so alright so on the top and the other thing is like I mentioned before it just gives you numbers on the back it doesn't actually say um, the shade uh, color or anything like that so you basically have to go by the numbers which has hmm, with me but uh, I guess it's because like I'd rather just say you know like what kind of shade this and that is you know so anyway the first shade I'm gonna swipe over which here it is here the whole palette this is a nice light pink tone but my lighting's not gonna show it as that um, but it's a real pale uh, pink color I'm not even sure if you still will see until I swipe it on my hand, maybe. The next shade is more of a taupe, sort of like a light taupe color. These are all shimmer. There's no matte in here, by the way, right there. So that's the pink one. This is like the taupey. And then this is more of a, if it's going to be, well, if it's going to be in the gold family, it's going to be a light gold or taupey gold or something like that. There's that there, so there's the three of them, whenever the light decides to help. Um, I have the pink one here, the middle one's the taupe, and then the one on the end there's like that um, golden, or not golden cut, but off gold, I don't know. Okay, then I'm going to go down to the next row, and that's when we get into more of the colors which this is a vivid hot pink so there's the hot pink one next one is like a turquoise beautiful turquoisey blue there it is there and then on the end is more of a gold so there it is there so there's the three shades on my fingers As you can see very pigmented when you swipe them so there they are there pink one has a little harder of a time, but it still comes out pretty good. And then the last row has a purple tone here. This purple is just your normal, to me it looks like your normal basic purple color. So there it is there. It's like, um, like a vivid purple. It's really pretty. The middle one this one here is actually like a duochrome. It's, I have this in several different palettes, this coloring. It's like um, a greenish brown offset. It's that famous duochrome that like does a greenish brown. This one's really pigmented though when you see. Look at that. That's crazy. So there it is there. And then the last one is your very dark purple color on the end here there. So there's the three shades there. That's insane. <laughs> yeah, that duochrome, this is probably the best green brown I've ever seen in the sets that I have gotten. So the purple's kind of doing that, vivid purple's kind of doing the same as the hot pink. It still comes off good, but it's just, you know, there's that duochrome, that pinkish, or I mean, <laughs> greenish brown, and then there's your dark purple. Working with them on my eyes, um, 
I did have to dip in a couple different times. I think, um, cause I, the last couple times I used a base, I used like the, uh, Mally's eyeshadow base. I used that and the Too Faced, uh, Shadow Insurance. Um, possibly, obviously, if I used more of a, um, um the Milk, All Famous Milk pencil, uh, to use as a base, something like that, it probably would pop even more. So the colors I ended up using, I do show it in my in my Get Ready With Me, but the colors I used, I used that pink color below the brown, I used this champagne in the center, in the middle part, in the, in the eyes, this golden color I did on one end and then in the inner corner and outer corner, and then put the champagne in the middle. I took this deeper purple and kind of even put it just a little bit, um, in the crease area um, to give more definition. I used the Sunny Bronzer from NYC as a transition kind of color just to kind of get a little something in there. And then this purple here, this bright purple, then I used up and through uh, a little bit of in the crease and above. So I blended in with this purple kind of to just go in with each other. Okay, so we'll go ahead and get ready into the video where you can see the get ready with me then. Um, I love these, I have the first one and then I'm, now this this one's here limited edition. I don't think the other one is the neutral one, but this one's a limited edition. But I would, I would highly recommend both of them. It just depends if you want the neutrals or the one with the colors and kind of just go from that. I will put a link to the video below that I did show of the neutral colors. So you can see them. Um, I love them both. Uh, maybe this one just a little bit more because the colors in here, like it, do, it does give you the colors. But um, I do like the natural one too because I I do like a good neutral eye. Um, probably because I have so many neutrals. Maybe that's kind of why I'm whatever with prone to this one. But I've been wanting to get more palettes with more um, colors in them too. And anyway, beauties, go ahead. I'll go ahead and get you to the video and you can say get ready with me um so yeah let me go ahead and get you right to the video
this with my Makeup Forever palette. Love the palette. Like I said, I recommend it to anybody. So, yeah, um, $42, and you can get it at Sephora. Don't know if you can get it anywhere else, but Sephora, I know, definitely has both of the Artist 1 and 2 palettes right now. So, um, so yeah, beauties, thanks so much for joining me. I really appreciate it. Thank you to all my new subscribers I have got, um, and thank you to all those who keep stick with sticking with me, if I can spit it out. Really appreciate everybody very much. And if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. That would help me so much, and I really appreciate it. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you. You can join me each week, and I have a couple videos up uh, within the week. Um, don't have specific dates, but you can come and join me each week. And uh, so click the subscribe button that's free. And as always, please, always, always, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let it be the shot for So until the next time, you will take care, and I will see you then. Bye-bye. Love you all. Bye-bye.